Bible reading time day 35, Jeremiah 35. This is the word that came to Jeremiah from the Lord during the reign of Jehoiakim, son of Josiah, king of Judah. Go to the Rechabite family and invite them to come to one of the side rooms of the house of the Lord and give them wine to drink. So I went to get Jezaniah, son of Jeremiah, the son of Habizaniah, and his brothers and all his sons, the whole family of the Rechabites. I brought them into the house of the Lord, into the room of the sons of Hanan, son of Igdaliah, the man of God. It was next to the room of the officials, which was over that of Messiah, son of Shalom, the doorkeeper. Then I set bowls full of wine and some, and some cups before the men of the Rechabite family and said to them, Drink some wine. But they replied, We do not drink wine because our forefather, Jonadab, son of Rechab, gave us this command. Neither you nor your descendants must ever drink wine. Also, you must never build houses, sow seed, or plant vineyards. You must never have any of these things, but must always live in tents. Then you will live a long time in the land where you are nomads. We have obeyed everything our forefather Jonadab, son of Rechab, commanded us. Neither we nor our wives nor our sons and daughters have ever drunk wine or built houses to live in or had vineyards, fields, or crops. We have lived in tents and have fully obeyed everything our forefather Jonadab commanded us. But when Nebuchadnezzar, king of Babylon, invaded this land, we said, Come, we must go to Jerusalem to escape the Babylonian and Aramean armies. So we have remained in Jerusalem. Then the word of the Lord came to Jeremiah, saying, This is what the Lord Almighty, the God of Israel, says. Go and tell the men of Judah and the people of Jerusalem, Will you not learn a lesson and obey my words, declares the Lord? Jonadab, son of Rechab, ordered his sons not to drink wine, and this command has been kept. To this day they do not drink wine because they obey their forefathers' command. But I have spoken to you again and again, yet you have not obeyed me. Again and again I sent all my servants, the prophets, to you. They said, Each of you must turn from your wicked ways and reform your actions. Do not follow other gods to serve them. Then you will live in the land I have given to you and your fathers. But you have not paid attention or listened to me. The descendants of Jonadab, son of Rechab, have carried out the command their forefather gave them, but these people have not obeyed me. Therefore, this is what the Lord God Almighty, the God of Israel, says. Listen, I am going to bring on Judah and on everyone in Jerusalem and everyone living in Jerusalem every disaster I pronounced against them. I spoke to them, but they did not listen. I called to them, but they did not answer. Then Jeremiah said to the family of the Rechabites, This is what the Lord Almighty, the God of Israel, says. You have obeyed the command of your forefather, Jonadab, and have followed all his instructions and have done everything he ordered. Therefore, this is what the Lord Almighty, the God of Israel, says. Jonadab, son of Rechab, will never fail to have a man to serve me.